Now that CEO Barbara Dravecki is stepping down after two decades, her focus is now making the transition as seamless as possible. She describes Planned Parenthood as being a staple in the country and will be strong well after she is gone. ABC 7's Dwayne Lindo spoke with Dravecki and is live at Planned Parenthood with more on this tonight. Dwayne. Well, good evening, Scott and Haley. It was the successful merger of Planned Parenthood of Orange and Collier counties back in 2015, expanding the regional organization to 22 counties, which was the catalyst for Dravecki's retirement. Bill Clinton was in office when Barbara Dravecki was named CEO of Planned Parenthood. Fast forward 24 years and three presidents later, she has now announced her retirement. Dravecki says the number of people the organization has helped during the years has outweighed the ugly rhetoric and threats throughout her tenure. I respect people's opinion to have their own feelings about um, reproductive health care, but what is the most um, memorable things for me are the, the thank yous the, and the gratitude. All while there's been a rising tide of harassment and attacks against care clinics around the country. Unfortunately, the society that we live in where things can happen everywhere, but of course, you know, you take necessary precautions. And now lawmakers in Washington are looking to defund the agency. She stresses the organization will serve the community for a long time to come. We're in the growth mode. We're um, opening a new health center in Tampa in the next couple weeks. And um, everything is set, I think, for um, moving forward. She says adjustments have also been made in case Medicaid reimbursements are taken away. But bottom line, according to Dravecki, it all comes down to one thing. Having access to family planning prevents the need for abortion, prevents the need for women to live in poverty, seems to be forgotten by these legislators. But for Carol Lipker, who has been protesting since the Roe vs. Wade decision back in 1973, her stance has not changed in more than 40 years. She's been a pillar of the intellectual community, but we hope this Planned Parenthood clinic goes away. Dravecki disagrees. Health care is a right in America and that people need to have access to care in a humane way. Now, Dravecki will stay in her role uh, until January while the board is conducting a national search for a new CEO. Live in Sarasota, Dwayne Lindo, your Suncoast News.